Welcome to the X-axis assembly. Begin with the carriage assembly. Stick two of the 13 and one quarter inch rods inside the carriage assembly into the idler bearings. Spin the rods into place very gently or you will knock out the bearing balls. With the rods in place, place the assembly in front of you horizontally so that the ribbed hole of the carriage is away from you and the smooth hole is closer to you. Take the idler piece with the belt opening facing left and insert over the right end of the rods until the rods reach the end of the printed piece. Tighten the bolts on the rods. Take the motor assembly with the motor facing towards you and the belt opening to the right. Insert over the left end of the rods until the rods reach the left edge of the motor assembly. Tighten down the socket heads, but only to hold the rods in place, as the length of the x-axis assembly will be adjusted later. Take a 25 inch length of belt and insert around the motor pulley with the teeth toward the pulley. Continue to wind the belt through the smooth hole of the carriage and around the idler until the belt meets.